my left, fighting out of the blue corner, wearing black trunks with white lettering, and fighting out of Brooklyn, New York. He weighed in at already 139 pounds, with a record of 21 wins, one loss, one draw. He has 15 wins coming by way of knockout. Please welcome the WBA number 15 ranked super lightweight contender, introducing the challenger, Vicious, Vivian Hayless. And his opponent across the ring is the defending world champion, fighting out of the red corner, wearing red trunks with black lettering, and fighting out of Miami, Florida, by way of Santiago, Cuba. His weight, 139 and three quarter pounds, with a record of 35 wins, two losses and one draw. He has 23 wins coming by way of knockout. Ladies and gentlemen, tonight he is making his first title defense. Here is the WBA Super Lightweight Champion of the World, the IBA Super Lightweight Champion of the World, introducing the Obeli Hurtado. Once again, our referee in charge, Lawrence Cole, now to give instructions, 12 rounds of boxing are scheduled. Come here, come here, Hurtado, Hurtado. Gentlemen, I gave you instructions in the dressing room. Obey my plan, stretch up all times. Good luck, was a good, clean fight. Bueno All right? Thank you. Now, Harris has won blemish on his record, came back in February of 2000 when he lost a 10-round unanimous decision to Ray Oliveira ever since he's uh, been firing away, and he hopes to take advantage of the fact that uh, perhaps the champion lacks some punching power, he's not physically strong, and he can be overly defensive at times, so this is what Harris will be banking on tonight, but with 15 KOs and 23 bouts, you know Harris can pack a punch. 12 rounds. Bout for the WBA Super Lightweight Champ, and here we go. Tato in the red trunks. Near the fighter with a reach advantage, as we mentioned motion a moment ago. Now Hurtado will try to take advantage here with his uh, good boxing skills and his awkward style. Case in point right there, huh? Matano's had some good fights. At the age of 30 from Miami, he's been in some wars. He's been around the block in this profession. He's fought some great champions over the years. I saw the sneaked in that left jab right there. Both fighters feeling each other out here in the opening round of this 12 rounder. Tato showing some strength here. Harris countering well. But the book on her Tato is that he's not overly strong. Good crisp jab by her Tato. Champion coming back with the right. Harris lunging forward, almost got caught by that right. Good right by Harris. With a left hook, has a title against the ropes. Oh, Harris winning that exchange. And Harris working that jab. Good, and left again by Harris. Boy, that haymaker from left field came storming in. Both fighters missing badly there. Guy Harris has had some tough times back in 2000. Uh, his career was uh, momentarily derailed by a stabbing incident. But as you can see, he's back in peak form. Oh, 
good right, good right lead that time by Harris, who's controlling this round. Give that round to Harris. Keep up. You gotta work the front. Right? Don't pull back too much. Watch his head now. I want you to pop to your left side and dig to the body. See, see when you pull him? Don't try to hook first over the head. Try to hook to the body. Okay, baby? Control the air and breathe. You got the best job in the business. Okay? It's now, the big reason. fight, the big fight that stands out on the ring record of Harris is back in June of 2001 when he scored a third-round knockout over NABF welterweight champ Golden Johnson, who we all know. And he could make a big name for himself tonight here in Houston, Texas. If he could upset the champ. Round two of this 12-rounder. The champion in the red trunks. Dubelis Hurtado. And this is his first title defense. And immediately, the champion goes down. Harris lunging. Hurtado's in deep trouble. Harris with a right and then following up with a left. And this stop in the fight. This stop in the fight incredibly. Hurtado is so dazed. We have a tremendous upset here in Houston, Texas. Look at Harris. Vivian Harris pulls off the improbable. A stunning upset with a second round TKO. Dethroning the WBA super lightweight king. 